Okay guys, so I just got this uh, package off of eBay. Uh, I won it at an auction. I've been watching this console for years now. I finally found one that had a great package. Uh, came with a quite a few games and um, you're gonna tickle, you're gonna know what it is once I start taking stuff out of the box, but I just wanted to, I just got it in the mail today. It took a while to come cross country and this is just a live unboxing of this retro game console. Wow, look what we have here. Wow. I'm sure you can guess what it is, right? By just by looking at the cartridges, but we got a Qbert cartridge. Donkey Kong cartridge by Coleco. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh. Nintendo Donkey Kong. What else we have here? California Games. Oh my goodness, I remember this. Another Donkey Kong. What else we got here? We have. Tron Deadly Discs. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Combat. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Let me put the similar cartridges together. Here, boxing. And yes, you've guessed it, it's the Atari 2600. Uh, Grand Prix by Activision. Oh my goodness, the legendary Pitfall. Freeway. Space Attack. Oh, lovely. Keystone Capers. Astro Blast. Armor Ambush, Utopia, Football, all right, I'm guessing that's American football, Baseball, Donkey Kong, Space Cavern, nice. Oh my goodness, this is in good condition as well. Defender. Uh, what's an Atari 2600 without Defender? Okay, that's like having an Atari 2600 without Asteroids. And I'm, I'm sure it, I, have, I have Asteroids in its collection. Anyway, here's Berserk. Mega Mania. Word Zapper. Ice hockey and an ice ice cold blue, lovely. Star Master. All these cool Activision games. Lock and Chase. Let me keep right over there. Actually, it's a different type of cartridge. Night Driver. Oh, yes, another favorite, Chopper Command. Brings back memories. Nexar by Spectrophil. Star Raiders. Let's move across the box. Make some space. Of course, Pac-Man. No, no surprises there. Uh, there was a Sega controller. I guess they threw that in as a bonus. The legendary TV game computer du dual impotent switch. So back in the day with the old TVs, you didn't have the fancy HDMI ports to like, you know, flat screen TVs and high def and 4K and even 8K. This is your basic, you know, um, your tube TVs. Uh, cathode ray tube TVs. You see, you need one of these, right? 
75 ohm output impedance. Oh, lovely. Brings back some good old memories. So you definitely need this. Oh, nice. I even have uh, some game documentation. Mint condition. Look at that. Yara's Revenge. We have uh, Circus Atari. We have Space Invaders. We have Asteroids. This stuff is in mint condition. Wow. What a find. This is Venture. Cubert. Berserk. Baseball. Defender. Star Raiders. Phoenix. And another Phoenix. Oh yes, pole position. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. Space Attack, Armor Ambush, and Night Driver. And these are in mint condition. I need more space. Let's just move this box across. We're still getting into this box, my friends. Let's just say it took me years to find this good deal. I've been hunting for a good, because there are a lot of Atari 2600s out there, but to get a package that has this amount of games and even some paperware uh, is the best. Oh, and we have some controllers, Atari controllers. I believe this one is faulty, but I can get easily a replacement one on eBay. Here is a third party controller. Oh man, this looks familiar. I've never seen that one before. We have the Atari power supply. And more cartridges. Grand Prix. Crackpots. Sequest. Oh my goodness. So let me just take this box off of here for a second. There's a box inside the box. Let's look at that first. Wow, when I told you we got a lot of games, I was not lying, my friends. Joust. We have Centipede. What? This is my favorite. Nobody could beat me on Centipede. Donkey Kong again. We have Baseball. Let me just move this control over here. Sword Quest. Desert Falcon. What's an Atari 2600 without Space Invaders? Here it is. Space Invaders. Moon Patrol. Here we have American Football. The original, the official carnival by Sega. Venture. Oh yeah, Dig Dug. Oh, this is the game of games. This is something that anybody who knows the history of the Atari 2600 and the huge landfill that hit that um, house, the worst game ever made. I think in video game history, it's good to have a piece of history. And that is E.T. the Extraterrestrial. Oh yes. And it's in mint condition. <laughs> uh, Pac-Man. Kangaroo. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Mousetrap. Boxing. Okay. And the Mousetrap. Venture. Pull position. 
Another one of them, kangaroo. Another Space Invaders. See, there's a difference to this one, right? Different, maybe a different version. Berserk. Still more games, my friends. Another Berserk. Space War. Yars Revenge. Combat. Yars Revenge. Got quite a couple, a couple of these additional ones I'm going to sell on eBay. Space Invaders. Solaris. Another Yars Revenge. Another Space Invaders. We have Joust. Sword Quest. Sky Shipper. Pole Position. Football. Okay, guys, make, make room, guys, make room. Put you over here. Missile Command. Sword Quest. Demon Attack. Fathom. Miss Pac Man. Another ETD Extraterrestrial. Qbert. Reactor, another Donkey Kong, Star Voyager, Phoenix, Baseball Game, alright, let me just move this over here, <laughs> Pole Position, Qbert, Popeye, Star Voyager, Vanguard, another Vanguard, Jungle Hunt, Star Raiders, another pole position, another baseball, this Pac-Man, Dodge him. You know what I'm gonna do? Let's make these paperware, put it right there. And we can put the remaining games here. Sword Quest, Berserk, Space Invaders, Circus, Atari, Asteroids, two Asteroid games. So this is from a collector, obviously, and he's been collecting them cartridges. Now there's one more thing in this box. Uh -huh. Actually, two more things. One here is the, we have the paddles, of course, right? And I got a, another power stick, so a set of paddles. And last but not least, in the box here. Oh my goodness. I can smell the 80s. Yep, this definitely smells like the 80s. And it's in very good condition. The Atari logo, that wood grain finish, and the switches are still good. Color, black and white, on off. Game select, game reset. And along the back here, we have our connector for the left connector port, right connector port. Uh, your channel, right? Depending on the channel on your TV, right? Um, and then we have difficulty, expert, A, novice B. You have, um, this is power, right? As we connect your power supply to. And then here we have difficulty A and B, expert and novice, expert and novice for each of the controllers. And here is, of course, where you put your cartridge. But what I like about this, this is in really good condition. Um, the Atari logo there. And at the back, manufactured for Atari Inc. And where does it say? It's made in Taiwan, not surprised. Let's put that right there. So guys, yeah, this is a 
retro game haul that I found off of eBay. Um, quite a lot of games. Yeah, there's a couple repeat, like double uh, repeat games. Uh, but all in all, it's a very good collection for the price that I got for it. Uh, of course, it was a ton of us bidding for it because it was a great deal. And uh, when I won, uh, I, it wasn't that expensive. It was still within budget, which was surprising. So you get these paddles, you get two controllers, you get three, well, four controllers and then two paddles. Um, ton of games. I think it's about 98 games. So if you look at all the, the, the repeat games, maybe you get a good, maybe 80 games, right? Uh, unique games, you get some lovely paperware. So just wanted to do an unboxing, so add this to my collection. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this Richie's Gaming and Gadgets and Gizmos video. Uh, the unboxing of a retro 2600, you got it, the Atari 2600. With a ton of games and uh, this brings back memories. So I'm actually going to set this up because I do have an old school um, TV. And I'm going to hook it up and uh, I might even show, uh, show some gameplay as well once I get it set up. So until next time, guys, stay safe and happy gaming. Bye-bye. So I hope you enjoyed that last video. Now, if you liked this uh, video and you liked it, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And if you subscribe to, to my channel, I'm appreciative of that as well. So thank you very much. Um, so listen, there's going to be a lot more content coming out this year and beyond. Um, I plan to be doing quite a few different types of reviews. And I'm also starting to do giveaways now, finally. So that being said, happy gaming and stay safe. Bye-bye.